What's going on guys? E.E. Fresh here back with a new LSPDFR episode. Welcome back everyone. Today we're going to be doing Texas Highway Patrol Department of Public Safety. You know, simply because we haven't done a Highway Patrol episode in a long time and I really, really, really like liveries on Texas Highway Patrol vehicles. And uh, today we're going to be using a Challenger which we haven't used in a long time. Let's do a quick walk around. The interior looks amazing and look at the lights on the uh, the back spoiler there. I just love how that all came out. Lights by the, uh, the license plate as well as back window. Plenty of lighting in the back there. Uh, the interior looks great with red seat belts. We have a computer. We have a couple of lights in the visors there. Mirrors have lights as well. And yeah, we, even the fog lights, we have a couple of lights there. So, oh, and even the grill. In the grill, guys, on, on the hood. Look at that. This vehicle just looks amazing. And we will, we will be doing a top speed run with this vehicle at the end of today's episode. My guess for the top speed is gonna be around I don't know 180 miles per hour let's do that it's an SRT Hellcat so it's supposed to be pretty quick but to start off today's episode we're gonna do a speed trap speed limit here is actually 35 miles per hour so we're gonna adjust it to pick up anybody going over 45 miles per hour they would be exceeding by 10 miles and uh, yeah let's see if we can catch some speeders guy right there is not wearing a helmet so let's actually uh, approach him we're gonna pull him over pull over buddy there we go let's uh, have him uh, pull over to the side of the road there we go we'll see why he's riding without a helmet today all right let me just go ahead and quickly run his license plate there's not a lot of traffic here today, so can't find too many speeders. Alright, he's got an expired registration. Can't be riding on an expired registration without a helmet on top of that. Let me go ahead and approach him. Um, get his uh, license, driver's license. How's it going, Officer hey. Iggy Fresh? Reason for the stop is you're riding without a helmet. Uh, can we see your driver's Get license, up. broke insurance, registration? This guy doesn't have a helmet either. Pete Malloy. All right, hang tight for me, okay? Actually, can we ask him a question about the... Um, no, not about the helmet. All right, hang tight for me, okay? All right. Man, this vehicle just looks so badass. I don't think anyone's wearing helmets here. Damn. Alright, let me go ahead and look him up really quick. Alright, move this to the side. Alright, vehicle database, Sanchez. Alright, yep, expired registration. Okay, alright. Uh, what else? Pet database, so let's look him up. Everything's valid, he's not wanted. Alright, well. Let me go ahead, we're gonna issue him a citation. For writing on the uh, with an expired uh, registration. All right, of course it's a motorcycle. All right, and this is going to be documentation and expired registration right here. Let's finish. There we go for citations. We can just see how much it's going to be now. Alright, oh, it's actually this one. Yeah, $200 fine, but he's gotten other tickets. So look at that. Illegal camping, speeding, driving while license revoked. Holy crap. Alright, and this is only $200. We're going to end up towing the vehicle. I'm not going to let him ride without uh, proper registration and without a helmet. So let me go ahead and approach him really quick. I'll have him step off the v uh, motorcycle. We'll give him the citation first, so. There you go. This is your citation for writing on an expired registration. And also, gonna have you step off the motorcycle. I'm gonna let you go. Whoa, buddy, relax. Okay, you're not getting a... 
Oh, he's got a gun. He's got a gun. Holy crap. Oh! Shots fired. Shots fired. Suspect is down. Don't move. Oh my gosh. He knocked my hat off. Are you kidding me? I was going to let him go. I was going to call him a taxi, dude. This is insane. Oh! What is going on here? Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, man. All right. We need EMS on scene. What the hell, dude? We need to block this uh, road completely. Damn, dude. <laughs> Did not expect this at all. Alright, we're gonna put a couple of barriers so nobody drives over the bodies here. We're gonna just leave one lane open. There we go. My gosh, that escalated. What the hell? This guy just... I was literally about to call him a taxi and he just pulls a gun out. Are you serious right now? And my hat is on the ground. Unbelievable. Let me go ahead and search his motorcycle. We'll see if he had anything illegal. Found a tourist map. Great. Alright, well, let me call for a tow truck for the bike. Oh, you got a med kit for me, buddy? Hi there. <laughs> All right, thank you, sir. Yeah, he's got a med kit for me. Perfect. Ray, thank you. We're gonna try and revive both of these guys. The bike was already picked up right there. Who else is coming? Oh, that's the uh, ambulance. All right, looks like he's deceased, and people are just don't know how to drive with one lane. All right, looks like both of them are deceased. I just called corner. Let me go ahead and uh, uh, get a new hat really quick. There we go. We got ourselves a new hat, and I think, yeah, I think corner is here. Let me just go ahead and open up the road. Otherwise, like nothing is gonna happen here. Um, let me just put one barrier so nobody drives over the guy. And uh, yeah. I think we should be all set here. Corner, come on. What is this truck doing here? There's no driver. I'll move it. I'll move it. Oh, no, the driver is here. Never mind. Literally, I didn't see the driver before. But here he is. I think they're going to drive off finally. Some of us have places to go. Alright, 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 alright. We're done here. Corners on location. Fire trucks leaving. Let's get out of here and see what else we can get into today. Dispatch calling unit one, Lincoln 18. We have a suspect resisting arrest. On Just got a call Joshua for a hot pursuit of a national off-roader. And there it is right here. Oh, just drove over a sheriff deputy here. We are in pursuit. Holy crap, heading northbound on East Joshua Road. Ooh, first person view is not amazing. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Speeds are about uh, 60 miles per hour approaching the highway. I don't, I don't even think I can pit him because of how massive the tires are. Let's make sure we cross safely here. We're good, we're good. Dude, pull over, man. All right, that's it. We're going to be aggressive, man. Oh! <laughs> I can actually go underneath this car and kind of spin him out this way. Right? Here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Worked out. Worked out. Let's block him right here. He's probably just going to drive over my vehicle like it's nothing. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, just as I suspected, we're not going to be easy. Not going to be able to stop him easily here. Man. Here we go. I can spin him out. Ooh, you know what I I think I've done in the past is kind of jam my car between his wheels, and that seemed to work. Let's try that. If I can do that. Oh, he's kind of stuck. He's kind of stuck. Oh my gosh, man. I can't jam myself in between there, but here we go. I think we're good. Let's pull him out. Get out, dude, right now. Get out. I think he's done. He's giving up. He's giving up. Uh, let me back up. I think he's going to get out of the vehicle really quick. There we go. We got him. All right, get on the ground, dude. Get on the... Where are you going? Don't move. 
Get him, get him, get him, get him. All right, I'm going to back you up. All right, this officer is going to place him in custody right now. Just got him. Perfect. That was a fun pursuit. Is that my car? Oh, I guess it was. All right. We got James Jordan. He's in custody. He's going to be going to jail today. Let's go ahead and do a quick search on him. He might be intoxicated also. Found the kitchen knife. Okay. All right. We have a unit coming to pick him up. No worries. Let me go ahead and search his vehicle. Man, this thing is a beast right here. Let's see what we find. Found a Zippo lighter. And that's about it. I wonder if we can even tow this thing. Oh, I think I've towed it in one of the last episodes. And it just looks kind of funny on the flatbed. But... Look, I had to sacrifice my vehicle, man. It's a little beat up now. The headlights gone, the grill. Man, we're done here. <laughs> Corner is here. Nobody died this time. You guys can go. <laughs> All right, I thought these officers were gonna pick him up, but we do have a unit coming, right? I thought so. Let me double check. Backup needed for a of course, we can't transport arrest. anybody today. Yeah, can't really place anybody in the back there. It's not a very uh, practical vehicle. But I think we're all set here. We have another unit here, and uh, yeah, let's see what other calls we can get today. Attention all units. Citizens report a drive-by attack on Sonora Freeway. Just got a call for a drive-by shooting. Let's go ahead and respond code 3 to that one. Alright, here we go. Vehicle is described as a black Comet 2. One of my favorite vehicles. Let's go ahead and respond. We'll try and catch up to the vehicle. They've done a drive-by shooting somewhere. Um, damn it. I think, I think they're going to be on the highway. So, let's just hop on. There we go. Oh my gosh, man. So many different sirens on this vehicle, too. Kind of cool. All right, here we go. All right, we're good. We're good. They're heading towards Grapeseed, it looks like. Let's try and intercept them really quick. And Black Comet 2 is usually a quick vehicle. Well, I guess not just black. Any color of Comet 2, but... Yeah, so could be an interesting pursuit. I'm right behind the vehicle now. Oh, they're running, of course. All right, let me get closer. Pull over, buddy. Oh, <laughs> they're off the road now. Let's block him in. Oh, no. Nope, 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 nope. They're going off-roading now. Oh, my gosh, man. Did not expect to do any off-roading today. Um, I think my vehicle would be better for off-roading than that Comet. Let's uh, smash into them really quick. Oh no, they're still still moving. Pull over. We need backup units is what we need. Alright, let me call additional units here. There we go. Got a sheriff unit. Block him in. Block him in. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Good job, man. Get out right now. Get out. Oh, shots fired, shots fired. Suspect has a weapon. Get on the ground, dude. Oh my gosh, man. Nope. You on, damn, dude. Get on the ground, dude. Get on the, oh my gosh. He just took a dive on his own. Get your hands up. Get on the ground, dude. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was funny. Took a dive on his own. <laughs> All right, we got him. Man, his passenger had a shotgun. And he just, like, almost took me out. That was a good shot. Um, all right, let's grab him. We'll do a search on him. And get him out of here. All right. That was a crazy pursuit here. All right, let me go ahead and do a quick pat down check. This guy randomly attacked me. I don't even know what happened there. That's his buddy right there. I think we have ambulance units coming. Yep, perfect. 
I'm gonna try and help both of them Come out. On, move it. All right. Um, have a seat for now. We'll call you to well come pick you up. Nope. Yeah, might as well get the body bag out. All right. Um, let me go ahead and get a tow truck out here. Pick up the weapon and uh, money for evidence. And yeah. We should be all sad, guys. And on this note, I think we're ready to do a top speed challenge. So, if you haven't guessed yet Why for the top speed on this vehicle, you make sure to leave your guesses in the comment section down below. My guess, once again, this 180 miles per hour. Let's go ahead and see what it actually is. Here we go, guys. We are ready to do the top speed run. Once again, my guess is 180 miles per hour. Make sure to leave your guesses in the comment section down below. And here we go. 80, 90, over 100. Honestly, I don't think we could do 180. It's still going to be pretty quick, but maybe not as quick as 180. Approaching 140 right now. Still going. I'm thinking maybe 160 is going to be the correct uh, guess here. 149, 150. All right, approaching 160 now. Come on, we can do this. 163, and I think that was it. 163 miles per hour was the top speed of this vehicle. If you guys guessed it, great job. But on this note, I'm going to end today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.